My name's Sean. Um, I'm on the men's tennis team. I'm a second year economics and mathematics majors. Yeah, um, I remember on my visit, I really liked the, the community here and everything. And then, um, then, and then the people on the tennis team too were awesome. Um, you know, I like um, I like now I get to you know go to war with those guys and then hang out with them outside of tennis too. It's uh, really great. So just uh, just the people and the community, I think, uh, really drew me to Oberlin. And then, and then I had some family members that went here too, so kind of got me on the radar. <laughs> I think Oberlin's a great place for people that really want to you know get after it, motivated that way. And then the Ashby program is uh, one of the prime examples of that, how you can do so many things at Oberlin. Uh, and you know, there's been lots of great experiences. You get to meet like some of the most like successful alumni and then kind of pick their brains, see, see what they did. A lot of them are also athletes too. So it's pretty cool um, just learning from all those guys and seeing what they did. And yeah, it's a great program. And then just so many, so many things like that at Oberlin as a whole that you could really take advantage of. For the Ashby program, and so in the fall we did um, uh, like a two credit course where we learned a lot about business and financial concepts like accounting, um, we did case studies, and then uh, and then for winter term we actually visited uh, like you know top business finance um, tech companies uh, where alumni worked at, kind of used that knowledge as you know background and kind of ask them questions about their work, about what they're doing. Um, and it's cool, we went to Boston, New York, Cleveland too. Um, visited companies like BlackRock, Fidelity, Google. Um, so it was just really cool seeing the alumni and see what they're doing, learning about their work. Um, and that was for the Ashby program. Um, and then, you know, outside of that, obviously the tennis team's great uh, as well. Really um, keeps you young. <laughs> and then, then some other things that I've been doing, I guess in particular is um, uh, well, it's Finance Club, um, Magicians Club, it's great, started that up. Um, yeah, I'm, uh, I think when I started high school one day, I, uh, <laughs> I just watched a YouTube video of like a magic trick and I kind of got caught down a rabbit hole. So it started with me just kind of annoying my parents, kind of showing them a bunch of tricks. And then, and then I just kind of gravitated a little bit more to you know, my high school friends. And then I actually started the club in high school too, in the, my junior and senior year. And then here I started it and it's a really cool like starting a club in college too, because you know, there's a, it's, a lot more, it's a lot more serious. You know, you get like funding, you have like uh, you know advertising all over campus, so it's been fun um, using that you know passion and hobby kind of on a college scale, showing a lot of peers around campus and getting the club going and, and using that as a platform. Pretty good with uh, card card tricks, but I have a good one where with a calculator I can use to get people's phone numbers. It's a it's a good one. It's a good party trick. Um, <laughs> that's probably that's probably my favorite one. <laughs> it's awesome to. To be able to come down here whenever I want, just just play with the guys, um, you know, uh, get a workout in, and keep you know keep competing. Um, uh, at least for me, I've always been competitive, so it's been uh, an important piece of my life, I guess, just to always be uh, keep keep competing, and, uh, and I'm and I'm super glad and lucky I can do that here at Oberlin uh, with my teammates. Like I said, I have this great facility, this great program uh, where we play other schools, compete. Um, it really complements the, uh, the academic side, and I think it all goes well together. I guess athletically, uh, for tennis team, I know last year we were pretty close to being nationally ranked. So um, maybe this year, next next year's, that'd be that'd be great. From a uh, I guess a quantitative, measurable goal would be uh, to get there. Um, but I mean, I think the goal is always kind of just to be to to improve, you know, just to get better, um, just you know, keep doing the best you can day in day out, and. Uh, that improving just uh, one step at a time, I guess, is a, is a real goal. Academically, uh, you know, Oberlin's great. Uh, it's a great school, so being able to use that and then use the skills from athletics, uh, you know, leverage into a, uh, hopefully a pretty good job after college or, or potentially uh, continued education.